Okay, this is the back side. So this is the west side of the outbuilding. Kind of see where the buildings are joined here. There's a little bit of rough wood. Remember I was talking about the edge flashing not lapping? Well, it's, we've got a whole gap right here. Got a whole gap right here. So we'll just kind of move on along. Try this. We got GFCI on the exterior. This is not even on. We got a light switch in here. We don't. Word from our sponsor. Good home inspection. Okay. So we're kind of moving on along inside of here. We're seeing how that. Well, let's go for the exterior. There's another sewer clean out, graded drainage, cracking and peeling paint. Some of our exposed rafters are a little worn, you know, where they took the rain gutter off. There's a, two electric service panels in here. I was peeking. There's one right here, an old Zinsco panel. I'll be able to get into that should be able to get into that. So we've got exposed NM cable. That's a GFCI protected. And we've got exposed NM cable that's closer to the six feet to the garage floor. So I'm not supposed to have that. Looking for things. Lots of storage. Got a damaged top plate right up there. Coming on along. I know I just tested this, so I've got that. This is a third panel. And I cannot open this one up. It's not labeled. But I cannot open it up because of all this storage. I tried. I got the bottom two screws off standing on top of this wood. Precariously as if I was in Circus Olay. And um, despite my valiant efforts, I still was not able to get past all that storage. And so this is not GFCI protected. Exposed NM cable closer than six feet to the ground. There's fluorescent. No, never mind. We should have GFCI up there too. We don't. Got all these gaps around these uh, overhead doors. Three of the four spring springs are missing. In the one existing spring for the door. Okay, uh, it does not have a guide wire going through it. These doors basically have exceeded their economic lives. It would probably be prudent to, I mean, you pay somebody and see where they've been working on them, patching on them, you know, making them work. You could probably make it work, you know. You also might want to invest, you know, in a couple thousand dollars and get a couple, couple new doors. So, 